Awesome. All righty, we're here. Um, so, yeah, the only difference is that I don't, everything is the same actually. Um, and I, I hope I have everything ready for you. If not, that's okay too. So let's, anybody is inspired to chant uh, Saraswati, anyone? I can do. Yep, Jessica, and okay. then teacher, Ariani. Good. Um, so just remember, uh, so when you do the Saraswati, make sure you get that Siddhir, you're landing on the kara, take off on a aspirate. So make really clear that it's okay. okay. Good. Right. Let's do it. Go for it. Okay. Oh. Saraswati namastubhyam barate kamarupini vidyarambham karishyami Siddhir bhavatu me sada. Ariane. Om sahana bhavatu, sahana bhunatu, sahavir yankara vavahe, te jasvina vadita mastuma vid good so ariana just make a note on your so you get the t it's long right t just t just it means light t just so t is long and then you have just is short just and then again go through where it's long and where it's short so you get that the a nice balance um another thing i wanted to uh share with you is when you do the <clears throat> you, when you do the um shanti shanti sh now the the shiva the shiva s is a hard and aspirate right so give it a emphasize on the <clears throat> Excuse me. Emphasize the 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 Shiva s. So sha make that little puff from the belly, and then when you come into the uh, instead of um, because there's a sandhi right there's a sandhi there, so the visargaha turns in the visargaha turns into a Shiva, so it's shantish. And then you have another Shiva. So it's it's double, double, you can say double force. So shanti, shanti. And then the last one is a norma visargaha, right? Because there's nothing following. So shanti, shanti, shanti. And then you have the, the last visargaha is with the um, with a puff, right? So, um, so that's uh, for everybody to, to remind yourself. So it doesn't go this shanti, shanti, because then you, Shiva is goes like, where's my Shiva is? <laughs> I want that powerful. <laughs> good, very good. All right, so where are we? We are here. Okay, so Sylvia, could you do the one, two, three, four, five lines? And make sure, um, again, all the Shiva make a really strong, like emphasize them, rather a little bit more than less. Mm -hmm. Om Shri Guru Pyo Namaha Harihi Om. Om Shruti Smruti Purananam Alayam Karunalayam Namami Bhagavat Padam Shankaram Loka Shankaram Shankaram Shankaracharyam Keshavam Padarayanam 
ಸೂತ್ರಭಾಷ್ಯೋ ವಂದೇ ಭಗವಂತ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಗುಡ್ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಮೇಕ್ ಎ ನೋಟ್ ಆನ್ ಯೋರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಗೋಸ್ ಶಂಕರ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯಂ ಯು ಸಿ ದಟ್ ದಿ ದ ದ ಯಂ ಇಸ್ ಶೋರ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಮೇಕ್ ದ ಇಂಟರ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ and mm-hmm. the other one was on line number 5 so when you come to so the first one is long right so you got that su and then you got tra and then the next one is long so you just uh-huh. made that short so mm-hmm. sutra bhashya right mm-hmm. and there is tricky because you have a uh, you got a murda right so mm-hmm. you go from aspirate and then you have to put the tongue in the right pos- um, position sutra bhasha kritao right so be careful here mm-hmm. yeah i didn't do the murdanya i i noticed when i was chanting i skipped yeah it. <laughs> yeah don't worry the, the, it's tricky all of it so you know when i say to one it means that it's for everybody because it's so easy to to fall off mm-hmm. and uh, so it's just a make a note good okay. uh beatrice can you do the same yes om shri guru bhyo namaha hari hom hom shruti smriti purananam alayam karunalayam namami bhagavat padam ಶಂಕರಂ ಲೋಕಶಂಕರಂ ಶಂಕರಂ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಕೇಶವಂ ಬಾದರಾಯಣ ಸೂತ್ರಭಕ್ಷ್ಯಕೃತಂದೇ ಭಗವಂತ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಗುಡ್ ಸೊ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಬೇತ್ರಿಸ್ ಸೊ ಯು ಟು ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಈಸಿ ಟು ಫಾಲೋ ಅಪ್ ಆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೊ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಟು ಯು um here is long and also here make sure that this is a diphthong uh bagavantao so it's long right it's a diphthong and uh there was make this uh do you, you can all see me right when i'm pointing the second line at the end when you go into the loka this is long loka loka mm-hmm. So this one is a tricky line this last one. Uh Alice can you do the same thing? So be careful on on line number 5. Thank you. Um, Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Hari Hi Om Om Priti Prananam Analayam is it just me or i didn't hear alice so well is that is it me or everybody no, i think alice your internet is not is is cutting is that correct for everybody yeah oh, yes okay. i didn't hear it very well all right so sorry alice we couldn't really hear it um vicky can you do the same thing yes om shri guru bhyo namaha hari hi om om shruti smruti purananam alayam karunalayam namami bhagavat padam shankaram loka shankaram shankaram shankaracharyam keshavam badarayanam sutra bhashya kritao vande bhagavantau puna very good um very good there was just uh this one second line second word 
this one was uh, make sure that that one is long can you see that yeah good all right um sylvia can you uh, do this one um let's do just two lines okay Ishwaro gururat meti murti bheda vibhagine vyoma vatyapta dehaye dakshina murtaye namaha good this did you see this one yeah this i one. noticed that i was like <laughs> it's, it's interesting because you you can catch yourself right yeah so and you were on the first you you did it first so it's uh you were on a, like a guinea pig <laughs> <laughs> okay ariani same thing iswaro guru ratmeti murti bheda vibhagine vyoma vadya tadehaye Okay, so this one is tricky, right? There's a lot of things happening here. So you got here is a vyo, ma, vad, and then here you have, because you have a dvitvam, right? So you have, this is the conjunct consonant. This one is a long. Be very careful with this one. Vyo, ma, vat, ya. Now here also be careful because it's a uh, this uh, tunis, right? Dakshin. You have to stay a half matra on the kakara. Okay, Beatrice. Ishwaro guru ratmeti murti bheda vibhagini. Vyoma vadya padehaye dakshina murtaye namaha. Very good. Make a note on the first one. It's a long. Ishwaro, right? It's not short. Uh, Alice, how's your internet? Do you want to try again? I've plugged in some. Oh, it's still cutting. Hopefully. Sorry, Alice, it's really, we can't really hear it. It's like on and off. Um, I just noticed, excuse, I just had the revelation that there are two conjunct consonants in this one. <laughs> I was like, wow, I didn't see it. It's the dya and then pta, right? Ah, no, it's not because it's a long ah. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah. Okay. It's, yeah, it's here. But it's tricky here. It's very tricky. Do I have uh, Jessica? Do I go vyap, vyap, or just vyap? No, you have to land on a kakara, and then you have to go make like the dvya, 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 dvya. You have to get all the consonant together. Ah, okay. Um, Jessica. Okay. Ishvaro Guru Ratmeti Murti Bheda Vibhagine Vyoma Vatvyapta Dehaya Dakshina Murtaye Namaha. Good. So, same thing. Long. This is long. Make sure, get used to your uh, positions. Pull the cheeks to the side. Ishvaro. Because then you have the, the length. Uh, all right, who is uh, uh, Vicky? Ishwaro Guru Ratmeti Murti Bheda Vipagine Yoma Vatyata Dehaya Dakshina Murta Yenamaha. Good. Okay. Love you. Make sure that you get this sound because it's such a beautiful sound. Make sure that that gets a hard aspirate. So, dakshi, you hear that? Like a really, is a strong aspirate. All the siblings are hard and aspirate. So, dakshi, dakshi, like you 
feel it. And if you want, you can put the hand in front of your uh, mouth and make sure that the, the air comes out strong. Dakshina. Because if it's just Dakshin, Dakshina. So Dakshina Murtaye Namaha. Good. Uh, who is, uh, who, la, la, la. I'm just, I'm sorry, I, I can't really see who's. Uh, Ali, sorry for jumping over you. It's not meaning, but it's just the internet is so. I know. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> okay, uh, Ariani. This, the next four. One, two, three, four. Om Brahmanandam Paramasukadam Kewalam Nyana Murtin Duantua Titam Gagana Sadrusam Tatuam Masya Dilaksham Ekam Nityam Vimalamachalam Sarva Diksha Shibutam Bawa Titam Trigunarahitam Sadgurum tam namami om. Good. Now, for all of you, look at here. So we got here, we got that beautiful sound, right? So, laksham, laksham. Put the hand in front of your mouth, make sure that the air comes out. Laksham. Then we had, um, there was one more, right? Um, Oh, here. So here you have sakshi, sakshi. Make sure that the hand, a lot of air. Now you can go through everywhere in your text and make sure that all the siblings, they have this hard aspirate. And, um, and also make sure that when it's long, it's long and short, it's short because you know how we <clears throat> normally we might read, a, you know, if we read a book, you know, sometimes we can we can stay on a letter longer and it's maybe it's fine in English, you know, once upon a time, you know, if you start singing and it's it just sounds beautiful. But here we have to be very specific, you know, when it's long, it's long, when it's short, it's short. So it's very important when you practice that you go through it and say, ah, here is long, here is short. And, you know, practice at home. So it comes naturally um, when you're chanting and, and, and you go like, okay, here it's long, here is short. And then it's much easier. Good. Okay, um, Sylvia. Om Brahmanandam. Paramasukadam kevalam jnana murtim tvandvatitam gagana sadrsham tattvamasya dilaksham ekam nityam vimalamachalam sarvadhi sakshi bhutam bhavatitam trigunarahitam satgurum tam namami om Good. Do this part again, the last one. Satgurum tam namami. Good, 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 very good. Beatrice. Om Brahmanandam Paramasukadam Kevalam Jnana Murtim Dvanvatitam Kagana Sadrisham Tatva masya dilaksham ekam nityam vimala machalam sarpadi sakshi bhutam bhavati tam trigunarahitam sagurum tam namami om. Good, very good. Make a note on this one is short and this is long. Uh, Jessica, same thing. Om Brahmanandam Paramasukhalam Kevalam Yana Murtim Vambaditam 
ಗಗನ ಸದೃಶ ತತ್ವಮಸ್ಯಾಕ್ಷ್ಯಂ ಏಕ ನಿತ್ಯಂ ವಿಮಲಮಚಲ ಸಾರ್ವಧೀ ಸಾಕ್ಷಿಭೂತ ಭಾವಾತೀತ ತ್ರಿಗುಣರಹಿತ ಸದ್ಗುರು ತಂ ನಮಿ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಜೆಸಿಕ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೀಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೈ ಬಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಬಿ ಟ್ರಿಕಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ಮೇಕ್ ಶೋರ್ ದಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಓ ಅಂಡ್ ಓಲ್ಸೋ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅ ಟ್ಯೂನ್ಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಯು ಗಾಟ್ ಯು ಲ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ಯು ಲ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ಅ ತಕಾರ ನಿತ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಆಫ್ ನಿತ್ಯಂ 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 so it's not nithyam mm-hmm. so little because those little small things makes the chanting so beautiful you know to 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 uh, feel this little nuances okay good okay vicky uh 1 2 3 4 lines yeah uh, let me just find the rhythm uh which one is the rhythm i don't remember this one. ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂಭಂ ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂಭಂ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯಮಧ್ಯಮಂ ಓಂ ಓಂ ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂಭ ಓಂ ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರು ಪರಂಪರ ಗುಡ್ ಮೇಕ್ ಎ ನೋಟ್ ಆನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಕೇರ್ಫುಲ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ವೆರಿ ಕಾಮನ್ that that <clears throat> because it's tricky with the uh, with the repa for a lot of mother tongues so a lot of times when you <clears throat> maybe hear people chanting and you know we're not there to correct them because you know they do it out of devotion and and bhakti and and, and it's beautiful but very common is that they it's it, they they can't it's so tricky for them to to get the sound the repa so you hear this maybe you heard this before like saraswati you know that saras it's like saraswati and when they're talking it's like this and th- this yeah. is very common but we have to notice that this this is a repa and it's a murdha and that means that um asmada char you hear that hr hr it's a hr so with that with you coming with air you're putting the position of the tongue and then the sound is completely different otherwise it's like par pariyantam pariyantam <laughs> i've heard it and it's funny uh, because uh, i don't have it it's not a, uh, i've heard it when i said it I, maybe i even laughed but it's funny because i don't have it in my mother tongue and when it came out of the Why did I say this? <laughs> How? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you know, I, I think it's great that you did it because then, you know, we we can see these things, you know, and how that, you know, even like in Italian, I know that you have the you have the rolling R. And uh, I'm not Italian. I'm Greek. Oh, and sorry, I'm saying Greek. really like r r. So, yeah. that's why I was like, how did I say this? But I think this why uh, brought me there. The yeah, Parian You know, I know. You know what, my my theory I could be completely wrong. I think that if you don't move your mouth, the tongue is going to go land more in the front. And if you don't have enough air, it's much easier to go par par. It's like that it doesn't have enough force to roll your r. So it's more it's it's like more relaxed but if you're moving your mouth and moving the engaging here like we have to do with our with our cerebral letters and kind of push the tongue back and the more we're getting to the you know the feeling you know the gong feeling the more we kind of go like 
oof, I can feel that sound. That make that sound is like resonating in your whole body. And then you go like, oof, okay, I'm getting it now, you know? So I think it was great that you, um, you're pointing to that, Vicky. It was great, really good. Okay, um, who is next? Uh, Jessica? Om Sada Shiva Samma. Shiva Samaram Bham Shankara Charya Matyamam Asmata Charya Paryantam Bande Guru Param Param Om. This this one seems to be a little bit tricky. So make for everybody, make it long. This is long. It's long. Yeah. And also another thing is this is um this is a dvikpam, right? So make sure that you're staying half matra, a little bit longer on this one. Um, Sylvia, <clears throat> same thing. Om Sada Shiva Samaram Bham Shankara Charya Matyamam Asmada Charya Paryantam Vande Guru Param Param Om. Oh. Very good. Beautiful. All right. Um, Beatriz? This is a tricky one. Um, this is tricky. So one, two, three, four. Are you okay? Is it too much, Beatriz, to go all one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? Uh, I'll try. Right. Il tabba, tabba, tara, Okay. Um, I don't remember the melody. Is it the same as the previous one? Om Bang Me Manasi. Okay. Om Bang Me Manasi Pratishtitam. Mano Me Vachi Pratishtitam. Avi Ravir Mahedi. Vedasya Mahani Hishtaha. Shrutam me ma prahashi prahasihi ane nadite na hora transandadami ritam vadishami sat ritam vadishami satyam vadishami tanma mavatu Tanma mavatu tadatra tadatara mavatu. Oh dear. So it's a tricky one. Off. <laughs> it's okay. You're doing really well. You're doing really well. So it's a, it's a really tricky one. So just a couple of things. This, um, this is the guttural. So you got to go from bang and go back in the throat, right? Bang me. <clears throat> And here's a lot of thing happening because you got uh, uh, mm. so you got to go manasip landing on a pakara pratishkita mm. and here is mano this is short and this is long mano me and mano. here we have another one um, ba chip ba you hear that ba chip ba chip so then the lips are ready for Pratishtitam. Let's, um, uh, Sylvia, can you do it again? And the same thing? All the way to Vakitaram, this one? Yeah, same. Om van me manasi pratishtita, mano me vachi pratishtitam, avira virma edhi, vedasyama anistaha. Shrutam me ma prahasi anenadhi te na horatran sandadhami rtau vadishyami satyau vadishyami tanma mavatu tat vaktara mavatu avatuma. just stop there. I think um, I fell off a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So this one is short, right? Yeah. And you, it's not long until there. Anena. So it's not ane, no. Mm -hmm. Anena. Mm -hmm. Short, long, long. 
This one, I'd like to hear this one a little bit stronger from all of you. Make sure you get that bang, la, 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 in the back of the th throat. Um, it's a hard one for me. <laughs> it's a hard, yeah, it's tricky. We're all gonna have, we're all gonna have certain letters that is like, oof, mm -hmm. how do I do that? Um, good. Uh, Vicky, can you do the same? Um, Vame manasi pratishtita mano me vati pratishtitam aviravir ma edhi vedasya vedasya ma ani ishtaha shrutam me ma prahasihi ane ane nati te na horatran and that Tami. Oh, oh, more? Ah. Oh, yeah, little bit more. Ah, okay. Um, Rutam, no. Rutam Vadish Yamim. Rutam Vadish Yamim. Tatyam Vadish Yamim. Tanma Ah, okay. Good. Very good. Uh, here, the, the melody. Yeah. Um, me, um, no, with a little bit. Aviravir ma edhi vedasya ma ani ishtaha shrutam me ma prahasi. So it was the, the melody. And um, work on this to get the sound out a little bit more on your the guttural. Uh, that might be also tricky if it's a tricky letter for you. So if it's tricky, <laughs> just go with the Ganesha, face it and go like, okay, come on, Ganesha, we can do it, we can do it. Uh, it's the same position as the, uh, the old, so you have that ka, ka, ga, ga, la, la, la. It helps to open your mouth, make space so the tongue can press on the soft part in the back of the throat. La, 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 la. Good. Uh, Ariani, can you do the same? Um, Aviravirma edi vedasya ma anistaha trutame ma prahasi anenadite nato ha anenadite nahoratran tandadami Yong wadishami, setyong wadishami, tang mama watu, tak watara mawatu. Good. So go through it. Short is short, long is long, and just practice that, uh, Ariane. Here is another one. Notice that this is unaspirate and this is uh, aspirate, right? This is and this is a short vowel and this is a long vowel, right? So you got san da. Da me, da da me. So it's like a drum. Da da, da da. So it's make sure that they don't they then they don't become as per both of them, and also um, the opposite. Like uh, so, it's one unaspread and the other one aspred. Okay, here we are. Here we are. Uh, so we can do. Just one line, uh, Jessica. Just the first line. Oh, sorry, did I forget this one? Uh, Jessica, can you do this one? Okay. And then the sorry, two lines. Avatu. Yeah. Okay. Avatu mam, avatu bhaktaram, avatu bhaktaram. Om Shanti Shanti Shanti. So just the uh, the melody. Avatumam, 
Avatu Bhaktaram, Avatu Bhaktaram. Mm. Just a melody. Uh, Beatrice? Avatu Mam, Avatu Bhaktaram, Avatu Bhaktaram. So it's, it's, a, it's a melody. It's a me Just listen to the melody. Uh, I think I sent it to you, right? Did I do that? Or did I miss that? I'm um, not sure. I remember this is the class I missed, but I'm still uh -huh. a bit struggling with this. Yeah, it's quite this. tricky. It's quite tricky. Sylvia? I'm listening again. Um, Avatumam, Avatuvaktarama. <laughs> Once again. Avatumam, Avatuvaktarama, Avatuvaktaram. Mm, doesn't want to come. It's okay. Avatumam, Avatuvaktarama, Avatuvaktaram. Mm, is that? I don't think that's it. Avatu ma, sorry. Avatu mam, avatu vaktaram, avatu vaktaram. Okay, I see. Avatu vaktaram, avatu vaktar. It goes quite mm -hmm. quick. Avatu mm -hmm. vaktaram, avatu vaktar. So, mm -hmm. okay, I give you what you can do, which is very helpful. You know, when is that kind of fast trans mm -hmm. uh, trans transitions, transactions, whatever you want to call it. Just put, instead of having the, the gap between the words here, move it here. So it's like you're saying, avatu vaktaram avatu. So it's like the makara goes here. Mm -hmm. Then you have a much faster, it feels like you're just connecting the words much faster. Avatu vaktaram avatu vaktaram. Mm -hmm. So it's like you're saying, avatu vaktara. And then you say, Mavatu Vaktaram. Just try that. It's like you 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 tricking your mind. You're tricking your uh, the way of thinking. Um, Vicky. Avatu mam avatu vaktaram avatu vaktaram. So there's a there's a there's a uh, swara here, um, but it's it's gonna come. It's gonna come. Um, did Jessica, you did, right? Ariani? You actually got, you, you got the swaras, but you did, you, you were breaking it. So this time, you, this time you have to just put it together. Okay, so just work on doing that. So, avatu mam, avatu vaktaram, avatu vaktaram. So the tricky part is here to put it together, right? Anybody else want to try one more time? I will. I, I will if it works for me. Yeah, go for it. Uh, let's hear uh, Alice. I turn my video off. Okay. I turn the video off and hopefully it works. Uh, where are we? Avatu mam, avatu vaktaram, avatu vaktaram. Mm. Are we going for the one mavatu or is it not? Is this no, that? You, did, you did really well. Uh, you did, so just, just, you did really, you got the melody and ah. just, um, just this little fellow in the end. So emphasize the vaktaram, mm, like be giving a little bit more sound. Uh, Jessica, did you want to try again? Yes. Avatu mam, avatu bhaktaram, avatu bhaktaram. So it's a melody. So just try again and again. Just listen to the uh, recording okay. and the swaras. <clears throat> it will come. Don't worry. Give yourself, remember to give you a clap on the shoulder because you're doing so well, all of you. And this is not easy, really. It, it's not like, it's not lullaby, <laughs> it's lullaby songs. Okay, Sylvia, uh, I think we're done here. Just the first line. Om yashcha sam prishabho vishwaro paha. Sorry, do it again. Om yashcha da, one moment. Om yashcha da sam prishabho vishwaro paha. Is this the melody? Mm. Oh, yes, so one thing is that this is a, you see there's a dvitvam here? 
Well, so you have to emphasize the Shiva. Shiva gets sad. He gets like, where is my Shiva is? So it has to be emphasized and it's a hard aspirate. Yash Chanda Sarisha Bo So um Vicky. Om Yashchanda Samrashabho Vishwarupaha. Good. Alice, do you want to try again? Om Yashchanda Samrashabho Vishwarupaha. It's the 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 uh, swaras, the intonation. Ah. Yashchanda Sam. It's up. Sam. Sam. Yes, Chanda Sam Rishabho Vishwarupaha. Beatrice? Om Yes, Chanda Sam Rishabho Vishwarupaha. It's the, the Swaras. <clears throat> and here you have a, uh, also you have a Dvitvam. Yes, Chanda Sam Rishabho Vishwarupaha. Um, Ariani? Om Yastanda Samr Sabo Vishwarupaha. This is long, Ariane. Make a note. This is long. Uh, anybody else want to try one more time? Or did anyone, did I miss someone? Okay. So just practice one to get the, uh, listen to the recording. Yastanda Samr Sabo Vishwarupaha. So, and this is aspirate, so this, and it's long, right? Okay, so now we're on the next one. Now, so here, <coughs> this is, this is uh, Thalu, right? This is a palatal. Chando bhyo dhyamrta at sambhabhuva. Not easy, not easy, but you asked me to teach you this. <laughs> All right, so start. Chando, chando, bio, chando, bio. Aspirate and long. Bio, bio. Uh, can you do up to there, Sylvia? Just halfway. Chando, bio. Long, long, long. Chando, bio. Chando, bio. Good. Beatrice? Chanto Pyo. Good. Vicky? Chanto Pyo. Good. Jessica? Chanto Pyo. Good. Ariane? Chanto Pyo. Good. Alice? Chanto Pyo. Good. And here? Jamratat. Jamratat. So it goes up here. Jamratat at at. Uh, Sylvia, can you do all the from here to here? Okay. Chando pyo jamrata at. Just a swara. Chando pyo chando. It's low. Chando pyo jamrata. Chanto pyo amrita at. Not amrita, because you have uh, jam, jamrita. Amrita. I guess I'm thinking about amrita. Uh, yeah. Well, you do have amrita in there, but it's uh, it's yeah. before. Uh, Vicky? Chanto pyo tiamrita at. Good. Alice? Chanto pyo tiamrata at. Good, just the swara here. Tiamrata at, at, it goes up. Uh, Beatrice? Chanto pyo tiamrata at. Uh, just the beginning, so. Chanto, sorry, chanto pyo tiamrata at. Uh, Sylvia, uh, Jessica? Chando Bhyo Dhyamrita. Good. Uh, Ariane? Uh, 
I can't hear you. I think you're muted. So make sure where is long is long, short is short. Go through it. Okay, last one. Sambabhuva. <clears throat> Here is tricky because you have aspirate and long. Sambabhuva. Samba. Sambabhuva. Um, Sambabhuva. Silvia, <coughs> all the way. Chando pyo tiamrita at sambabhuva. Good. So just practice to get the sound a little bit stronger. Uh, Vicky? Chando pyo tiamrita at sambabhuva. Good. Alice? Chando pyo tiamrita at sambabhuva. Just practice the swara so you get the, the right swara. Beatrice? Chando pyo tiamrita sambabhuva. So practice where it's short and where it's long. Same thing. Uh, Jessica? Chando pyo tiamrita sambabhuva. Sambabhuva, sambabhuva, sambabhuva. Sambabhuva. So get the the, the right Sambabhuva. Good. Uh, okay, so let's look into what you're chanting. Okay. Um for the the adorable the people who love Sundays. Here is a Sunday. So the word is actually chandaha. Chandaha. And um, here, so the word is chandaha. So I think I said before that it's, you know, you have anushtuk chandaha, you have trishtuk chandaha, you have gayatri chandaha. And in, in, the, uh, in the old, you know, in the curriculum, you know, when they were studying, they, they, were, they were spending like six months just studying the, the, the meters of the different prayers. So that the word, Chandaha is referring to meters, but in this case, is referring to the Omkara. So the 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 very auspicious, the the the, um, the sound of Om, that is uh, is a sound that um, is very auspicious, and, and uh, you know you can go into to understand the, all the little details, but but it, it gives. The sound, all the, the all the bija, mid, ma, ma, bija mantras, including om, um, especially om, uh, gives is called adrishta palam. Palam means fruit. Uh, so and adrishta means unseen, unseen. So it means that palam is like palam doesn't mean like fruit, fruit like what we're eating. It means effect. So when we when we chant, you know, prayers or we're chanting the the bija mantras, remember just to do the bija mantra always with another name, because it's very powerful. Um, so don't go and just do a mala with om om because it's very strong. So you can go om sarasvati namaha. That's okay, but uh, but not by itself. But it's, it's uh, so in this case, it's referring to the Om Karaha. So the, uh, the, the Om. And here you see that it's a, uh, it's the, it's a O and Shandu um, Yu. Oh, sorry, sorry. This is referring to um, Abhyaha. So here is uh, akara, sorry, long a biha. That's a pronoun. Uh, it's a pronoun. It's like fifth case plural. Fifth case, just to complicate it for you, it, it's uh, from. So from this unkara. Uh, mm -hmm. And then this one is called. Um, you see here in the Devanagari, it looks like a Superman sign. See that? 
This is called Avagraha. This is, uh, you're gonna learn, some of you might already learn this, this, this swallowing the Akara. So you see how you chanting, you're actually chanting Jamratat, but the word is actually Ad, Addi. Here is a, a, Akara is here, and this is a Sandi. So the word is actually Adi, Adi, because here is a Sandi. Uh, I think, where, we, where are we in the Sandis? I don't think we've done that. Uh... We haven't done that yet. It's coming up. <clears throat> Adi, Adi is, uh, is uh, indeclinable. It means that it's, it never changed. It's like, it's like uh, cha, uh, like means like and. This is mean, adi means etc. It's like, uh, and, and, and like so a lot of times you see in the, in the scripture, they say one word, but, and then they have adi and they're referring to all, for example, they're all the um, karma indras, indras. So, so they say one, but they're referring to all of them. And Adi is like etc. So by saying one word, they're referring to all of them. And here, like like Silva was saying, Amritat. And what was it? Silvia? Amritat thinking. Amritat. I get confused because I want to say food, but I don't think it is food. But when we give the puja, I have it in the puja chant when we offer food. That's why I get confused. Yeah. I can't remember. We, we <clears throat> talked about it and now I for is it deathlessness? Yeah, it's called Death. it's um it's deathlessness. Ah, I got it. Wow, got thank it. you, Mevha Devi. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. Amrita. It also means the uh, the um, is sometimes it's referring to the nectar. Right? And of course it's not like just the nectar, it's like then then it's um then it's amplify, uh, amplify. Um, it's the, the, the significant, the word itself is, is moksha, right? Uh, Amrita. I know why I got confusion because here in the fight, the puja, there is this amantra, Amrita Nikaye Shin Dengaras, Amritam Mahane Vedyam Nivedayami. So I guess I connected it to food, but it means the one that is more giving deaf, deathlessness, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. So, so it can have many, many, many meanings. Mm. So, but it's very common. Mm. So, a lot of times you see mur, mur is is referring to something uh, like with death. Ah, and like mrit <clears throat> The akara is declining the death, so it's like mortal, immortal. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Like the Mrtvijaya ma mantra. Huh? Is that is that good? Am I ma making good connections? Say it again. Mrtvijaya mantra. Huh? Mrtvijaya mantra. Huh? Yeah. It's also Mrt, right? Yeah. Mrtvijaya. Amritam. Amritam. Nekta. You know, you have a lot of uh, Puranic story about Amritam. You know how they, you know, the the turning of the Milky Ocean. Do you know that one? The Puranic story, right? The turning the devas and the asuras, they the 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 they're turning the milkish ocean to to extract the uh, the amritam, right? The amritam, they're extracting the nectar. They want the nectar. So what is it? They 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 want the moksha, but at the same time, because it's the milky ocean, you know all these these uh, things that coming from the bottom of the ocean is coming to the surface. So what is that reflecting our own life is that, yeah, you know, when we, when we start, when, when we're going through our, the journey, you know, things gonna come up from the milky, it's gonna come up from the bottom and we, things gonna, we're gonna have to face things, right? We're gonna have to face our, our demons. We're gonna have to face our, uh, the monster. We're going to have to face our fears because otherwise we can't reach the, the nectar. 
and then nectar is ultimate you know the absolute freedom absolute immortality that we notice that where we, where we are completely you know we freedom com absolute freedom not because of any situation not because of any relationship not because of any setup we're completely unsettable you know and, and we can stay in any kind of situation and be like <sighs> And that including like facing the fear of death. And like now, you know, I'm in Sweden and, and, and I see the amount of fear that is here. It's so interesting, you know, and, 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 uh, and, um, and, 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 you know, you, you're not there to correct them and point the finger, you know, they are where they are. And, uh, but, but at the same time, not jump on their train and, and stop, you know, going into their, their prarabdha, you know, stay in the green room and, and be relaxed and, and, and uh, chant, <laughs> chant, chant the prayers, much more effective <laughs> than watching the news. Okay, good. Okay, anybody remember what some, uh, I think we had that before. We had it here. Anybody remember that? It has, it's a, it's Beautiful. a prefix. It's very a, well. like, or so? Like very well. Yeah, prefix. good. Very well, like in, in, increasing something, like very, very well, like. Okay, here, you know how we have uh, om buhu, om buvaha, you're right? Buva, you're right, everybody know. So one of the, uh, one of the dhatus, uh, the first, actually, the first dhatu is bhu. You see this here? Bhu. So it means, uh, it, um, it can mean uh, is or exist. Is or exist, like exist. Now, this one happens, this is a little bit grammatic, but this is a dupl uh, duplication. This there's a lot of, um, it's called lakar. Uh, you have, you know, you have present, you have past, you have, you have 10 different uh, tenses and modes that describe uh, in Sanskrit. And uh, we, we haven't touched that yet because we're on the Sundays for the, for the level two. But um, later on, maybe in the future, we look at these things. But, but basically what happens is that in, it's called lit and it, it's uh, um, imperative. So it's like, let it, like may it, let it exist. So, and what happens is also that is a duplication. So that's why you have ba and then you have bhu va, ba bhu va, ba bhu va. So it means may it, May it be, may it be. So the omkara, uh, those those uh, sounds in from the from the Veda, that teaching us about deathlessness, as giving us our ultimate freedom, that giving us the alt. Every human being is seeking happiness. Every human. But very few people kind of really question it and say, wait a second, I'm, I've been chasing all these balloons all my life and it still hasn't given me uh, <laughs> happiness. Must be something more. It must be. It can't just be this. It must be something more. And those were the, the few people that you are that kind of start even questioning that is seeking moksha. And when those, so say the seeking, you know, the right people will come into your life and, and, you know, you might have to go through some monster and demons and betrayal and, you know, all that way. But, um, and that's part of it. That's part of the fun or not, whatever you want to use the word. Um, but that, you know, you will be tested, but you will come to a place where you can relax and you can be focused on the on the knowledge. So may it exist, uh, may it be, may it be a very place for 
you know, listening to the, uh, the, um, the auspicious sounds of the Vedas. Okay, beautiful, huh? So next time you chant this, you know, take the, take the meaning to you. So it's like really, wow, it's so powerful, right? Divi, hmm? could you just in a few words, I don't remember the, I can always go back to the video, but if you could just say the first sentence meaning, please, as well. This is, this one you mean? Yes. Mm -hmm. So, yes, it's yaha. Mm -hmm. It's uh, it's a pronoun. The, and and uh, that. This is the, uh, referring to the, um, the, the chanda, the, the omkara. Mm -hmm. uh, very well, like very well auspicious with the, all the um, form and, and uh, all the, uh, all the forms, you know, you can, you can see uh, in, in, that's a beautiful thing when you, when the, in the Vedanta is not to go into a nirguna place, you know, you can go into a satguna, that means that you can look at everything around you and see Ishwaraha, right? You can appreciate your your uh, the trees, your mom, your own body, and, and and go like, okay, this is how it is. And you can go into object objectivity and see how perfect everything is in perfection, you know, and everything is so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Good. Great. Okay. Shall we do our final? Anyone is in, feel inspired to chant? Um, I can do. Yes, I can. Go for it. The universal prayer? Yeah. Okay. Om Swasti Prachabia Paripalayantam Nyaye Namarge Namahim Mahishaha Go Brahmane Vyashvamastunityam Loka Samasta Sukhino Bhavantu Kale Barshatu Parjanyaha Prithivi Sasya Shalini Desho Yamsho Bharahitaha Brahmana Santu Nirbhayaha Om Sarve Sham Swastir Bhavatu Sarve Sham Shamtir Bhavatu Sarve Sham Purnam Bhavatu Sarve Sham Mangalam Bhavatu Sarve Bhavantu Sukinaha Sarve Santu Niramayaha Sarbe Bhadrani Bashyamtu Makashit Dukhabad Bhavet Asatoma Satkamaya Tamasoma Jyotir Gamaya Mrityorma Amritangamaya Om Purnamada Purnamida Purnat Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om Shanti 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 Harihi Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Harihi Om Thank you beautiful goddesses. <laughs> Uh, next week I'm moving on Monday, but uh, and I'm doing my best to uh, next Monday, and I'm doing my best to be set up with all the all the tools to to have a class. But um, if anything happens, I let you know. All right. Thank ciao. you so much. Ciao, ciao. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Oh. Thank you.